Hi, it's Jim. How you doing? It's Monday. We got through the weekend. More importantly, I got through the weekend. I didn't think I was going to. The computer died. The computer gave up the ghost at the end of last week. And try as I might, I could not get it to to limp through for another month or two. Um, it still has a bit of life in it. I think I'll be using it as a as a, just to network it up to the to the new one and store um, my uh, music on it or the sort of the music files. But uh, it's just it just cannot cope with editing. Now today I thought, yay, it's all good. We're going to get going. We've got the new computer. It's a goodie, but that's a bit of a steep learning curve. I mean, it's, it's it's crazy because it's this, exactly the same environment in which I've been making videos for the last five years and the same computer system that I've been using for the last seven or eight years, um, if not longer. But because it's a new computer, I always forget this. Everything is different. All the settings are in the wrong place. Your way of working is completely up the spout. You have a sort of an absolute sort of a workflow that you can't get used to. And nothing's where it's meant to be. Nothing's working right. Do you ever have one of those days where every single thing that could possibly go wrong goes wrong? Well, today has been that day. This is the second time, I'm being absolutely honest with you, this is the second time I've had to film this uh, video that I'm doing now. So although I'll be saying, oh, this is cool. I mean, I literally heard it two hours ago when I did this the first time and the whole lot just went to pot. So I'm having to redo it. Um, I'm being utterly honest with you. Now, it wasn't this bit that was wrong. The camera has worked perfectly. So I've got uh, 30 minutes of footage of me talking to a camera, listening to the music. I could listen to the music. I could hear it. It was all working brilliantly. And then, lo and behold, screensaver pops up on the computer, which I'd forgotten to disable because, you know, why would you? It's always disabled. No, it's not. You have to disable it. And, of course, the audio stopped recording. Everything stopped recording. I said, no, come on. No, don't do that. Ah, and it took me ages to sort that out. Got that going again. And then, okay, come back outside. Oh, no, went back in, got a cup of coffee, came back out again. And so, why is everything only coming out of my right ear? Something's not right here. And I said, oh, God. I had to spend the last 20 minutes or so trying to dismantle my headphones to solder up the cable again to get it all working. And it's every single thing that could go wrong is going wrong. Uh, now, I have... What is the time now? I have one hour between starting now and leaving the house. So is this going to get done in time? I doubt it. We'll see how fast the computer really is, but I don't think it's going to be fast enough to get this <laughs> done. Right. We are listening to... Boo Boo. That's right, you heard me correctly, Yogi. It's Boo Boo. This is a band called Boo Boo who come from Argentina. Now, I really, really don't know what it was that spurred me on to get this. It was... Uh, I've had it now in the record collection for uh, maybe a year, and I think I probably spoke about it on one of my Vinyl Hall uh, videos. Um, but I can't remember when I heard about it. I think I either I read about this record or I heard a snippet of music and I thought, oh, I really want to get that. But I've gone back through all the comments. Nobody has commented on this or asked about this band at all. There's not one comment in the five years of making videos. Now, I will tell you now, because I've listened to this already, this is absolutely fan-bloody-tastic. This, I mean, I was, um, one of the things I said when I was listening to it first time round a couple of hours ago is that I've been listening to this amazing sort of prog music enough now to recognize something that is really special and believe me this is I don't know why this isn't in the collection of every single person who listens to yes and to Genesis and to uh to King Crimson because it's kind of it is up there with it. I mean, it's a little bit late. It's 1978, so it's had obviously uh, five or six years worth, if not a little bit longer, of other people's music to uh, get into the mood with, but uh, or to get to, to, to ride on the shirt tails of, let's say. But it's uh, but that is just so well done. I think you'll agree. Hopefully, you'll stick with this and listen to this. Um, so let's get on and listen to this, shall we? Here we go. There we go. 
Right, so, you need me to tell you about this music. I, I cannot. <laughs> um, the band is Boo Boo. The album is Annabellas, or Annabellas. There are three tracks in total. Side one, a faz e, because this is all in Spanish. El Cortejo de un Dio Amarillo, which is what we're listening to now. We're here for 19 minutes. Side two, El Viaja de Anabelas and Suenos de Manaki. But let's just let the music do the talking. Everybody's playing a different piece of music at the same time. Amazing. This is a, as I say, 1978 recording. But the 
stereo use of this is really good. Really good. So I think this is a remaster, but not, not necessarily a re remix. Quite a big band. There's eight people in it. Yeah, violin, flute, tenor sax, primary vocals. I think it's difficult to know because I don't speak Spanish. Guitaros and efectos. Banjo. I think that might be bass. Battery, drums. Composition e Araglos. I wonder if that's arrangements. I don't know. It's really difficult to know.
special isn't it really good I was amazed or am amazed at how really good this is considering it's an absolute unknown bit of a bit of, bit of a risk reminds me of Haken. times I've listened to these videos, or, sorry, listened to these records, is um, anecdotal, and I think anecdotal themselves 
have this sound which is very similar to King Crimson. So this, but I'm not listening to a great deal of King Crimson. I'm listening to more anecdotal. So that's kind of my why I keep referencing them all the time. But I can hear them in here a lot. Can't disagree with that, eh? I have got to. I'm. So, I've got to say, I'm so impressed with this record. It, absolutely stonking. Really good. Really, really good. Um, I hope you're enjoying this. Uh, I'm not going to talk too much now because there's. Uh, I, I want to try and get this video out if I can today. So I just need to sort of wrap things up quite quickly. But um, I'll be listening to part two tomorrow. And I hope you'll join me on that. I hope you enjoyed this. And with a little bit of luck, I'll see you guys on the next video, whenever and whatever that is. And until then, this is Jim over and...